Hello everyone. Welcome to another Array's Easy Level question. Now this question is a pretty easy one. This video is going to be a very small one. Okay. Um, only the question is given is in, in a twisted language, but it is not that uh, difficult to understand. So basically, we are given. Uh, if we go into the uh, question first, we are given two arrays, seats and students. Okay. Now what we have to do is we have to move our student at ith position or jth position to some other position given in the seats such that the student has to make the minimum of movement okay uh, if i'll explain it here let's say uh, we are at student 2 in our this example we are at zeroth index the student is at two a second position right now so we need to move it to the minimum uh, among this okay now if you will see uh, either 2 minus 3 that is absolute value of 2 minus 3 that is going to be 1 and 2 minus 1 is also going to be 1 in this example i will take 1 so 1 is occupied now 2 minus 1 is 1 plus okay sorry 2 2 minus 1 that is going to be 1 plus now 1 is occupied so we can't take that so 7 minus 3 that is 4 4 is minimum as of now 7 minus 5 that is 2 so r2 is minimum so 2 now if you will see 1 and 5 both are occupied so the last student has only one option going to 3 so 4 minus 3 that is going to be 1 that is equals to 4 okay now how will we do that uh, finding and taking care of which a place is occupied and where we got our minimum so basically what we'll do is we will sort both the arrays okay and then we will take the difference of uh, of the values at ith index in both the um, arrays okay so that will be uh, really really simple okay so let's dive straight into the code so first we'll sort our arrays uh, that is seats and our students now our values are sorted now we also need to understand that how will we get our optimum result because you know uh, we need to take difference but at this point we are not sure whether the values at seat is going to be greater than student or the uh, other way okay so what we'll do is let me first create our final um, result i will assign it to zero okay and uh, next what we'll do is we will go through our arrays now for both the arrays we have the same size so we don't have to worry about that uh, we can take either seats dot size or students dot size it, it won't matter now we need to take absolute value of what seats at i sorry i minus student at i position okay and at the end we will simply return our result Okay, let me submit this i'm sorry it's my mistake um that's not how we do sorting in c plus plus so seats dot end okay same here begin and students dot end okay so our sorting is done let me submit this again okay so it is that simple um just i forgot how to sort in c plus plus um so that's it for this video do let me know if you have any other suggestions or queries for me to solve from any other platform okay uh thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one till then keep coding